All right, good morning, everyone. I hope you guys had an awesome weekend and an awesome morning. Um, go ahead, chat with your neighbor, uh, discuss what you guys did this weekend. I went swimming. I went on the Easter egg hunt. I got Lions to Lions of the Bay. That's crazy. Did you get an Easter egg How come? The Easter egg didn't come to your house. I've been bad, Mom said. Oh, that's not good. All right, guys. Okay, John, why don't you explain what you did this weekend? Um, I went swimming, but I didn't get an Easter basket because Mom said I've been bad, and so I cried. She made me cry. She made you cry? Yes. Yes, Tessa? Easter Bunny came to my house. Did she? Mm -hmm. Yeah? How many eggs did you get? Ten. Ten. Oh, I'm sorry, John. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, guys. In the past years, you've learned about basic addition um, and grouping of numbers. So, for example, two plus two plus two plus two, which is... Yes, Maddie? Eight. Good job. Okay. So, today we're going to learn a fast way of grouping those numbers. It's called multiplication to help us learn. We're going to use this book called The Best of Times by Greg Tain. And today we're going to go over the twos and the fives. Two step. Two is very fast and fun. Quickly double and you're done. What's that you say? Be more precise. Okay, then just add it twice. So what is two times two? It's, it's two doubled. Tessa? Four. Right. Two plus two is four. So what is two times eight? It's just eight doubled. Fourteen. Sixteen. Can you raise your hand, John? Yes, John. Sixteen. Good. Two times eight. Yes, Tessa? Is that kind of like eight plus eight? Eight plus eight. Right. So two times eight is the same thing as eight plus eight which is 16. Good job. Let's move on to the fives. Five alive. Five would yield the right amount. It's by fives you will always count. Or else just multiply by 10, half will get you there again. So what is, so here we have two groups of five. So what is five times two? Yes, Maddie? 10. 10, good job. So you have your group of five here, your group of five here. And what is 5 times 8? Yes, Tessa? 40. 40, good. So 5 times 8, and then here we have 10 times 8 divided by 2, because it's 10 eighths divided in half, which is 40. Okay, now that you know more about the multiplication, we're going to dive into the 2s and the 5s. So, we have here... The 2 of 5. So multiplication is 2 times 5, but an easier way to look at it is 2 of 5. So you have two groups of 5. Okay? So 2 times 5 is, John? 10. Good. Getting it. I like it. We're working it. Okay. Okay. Let's move on to a little harder one. 4 times 5, or 4 groups of 5. John? 20? No, not 20. That's half. You're halfway there. <laughs> Tessa? 40. 40, right. So do you know what you did wrong, John? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so it says count by fives. We got 5, 10, 15, 20. Four groups of five, okay? All right. So I've got a couple worksheets for you guys to work on. Um, and if you don't finish them in class, you can take them home and work on them and bring them back tomorrow, okay?